All right, are we ready? Are yes. We're ready. We're ready. Is that my voice? <clears throat> All right. So, <laughs> what? Struggle every time. Yeah, is that my voice? Wait, wait. Is, is that it, my is voice? That my voice. <laughs> is that my voice? Is that my voice? All the recordings start like that. <laughs> is it, is it, you should have rolled, rolled a bard, man. You should have rolled a bard. There's a bard in the background like... La, 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 la. Is this my voice? No. You're pitching no, too high. Now he's testing without the sound. When you are doing a cappella and you have like the, the thing to just tune. Mm -hmm. That's what he's doing. <clears throat> Alright. So... Last time, you guys finally entered Neverwinter. Uh, you were greeted by the city, the smells, uh, all the activity that comes with it. You tasted some of the meat uh, as soon as you came in. Uh, and then you proceeded to try and find an inn, which took a lot more conversation than it should. Than it should. Slightly. Uh, you, you finally started to make your way to uh, Semat's Kalimbor's temple. Uh, on the way there, you stopped at an armor shop uh, to get some gear. I think uh, Semat bought an armor to Tamara, which was unexpected. And expensive. And, and, and very expensive. Uh, and also, I think Fern and Cade both bought an armor or only Cade. no i didn't buy anything i did i was looking for and... a splint mail but you didn't have any right and, and you did know we we bought something else yes so <laughs> <laughs> while leaving the armor shop you went to a leather shop why you requested some uh, interesting uh, custom, work. Cu custom work. The, you were initially taken like uh, a farce or uh, uh, not seriously. But then the guy complied and you should have your saddle ready in about two days. I'll accept saddle. Saddle's good. Uh, I thought we agreed on Furnook. Fernux. 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 No, Fernux is the bit. position. It's okay. called, it's the duel. It's the power. Okay. Yeah, the power it. couple. Fernook, deploy. The Fernook contraption. Oh. Ooh. And then uh, you finally arrive at the temple of Canvor. Everyone uh, visited. See the serenity. Um, you met with Kira, the high priestess. Pre pres priestess. Priestess. priestess and um uh and Samat took some time alone with her to confirm his doubt uh about uh, his uh -huh. belief uh he had the conver confirmation he was looking for that uh like his god is more against death than against necromancy as a an energy and that he was on the right path and um seeing the sacrifice that he made uh and as as good as his beliefs belief were and he was proving it he he was rewarded with an artifact given by kira which uh turned out to be uh a pendant of i don't remember what where did we saw it? Was um, it on the... I put it on both Discord and um, Road20. It was... Yeah. Yeah, the pen per period of wound closure. Exactly. What Good is stuff. dead may never live. Yes. <laughs> Indeed. <clears throat> and uh, you guys found the inn, favorite uh, place of Semat, close by. Uh, you 
had some time for a drink, food after a long journey was first like warm and good food that you had uh, in about two, about four days, I think. Mm -hmm. Was it? Yeah, about four days. <clears throat> and you bedded down to for the night. It is now morning. You had time if you wanted to uh, uh, revise your spell, heal up, chat, all that good stuff, attune to items if needed. And uh, it's now the morning. Everyone is coming uh, awake. It is cloudy, muddy. It's not a. Uh, there's like fog in the street. It's still pretty early. Uh, there is people having breakfast in uh, the common room of the inn. And the day is yours. <clears throat> and it's going to be about five silver per person per night. Jeez. It's expensive. This one is expensive. I pay the yeah. I I pay for some ad. Ooh. So well, I'll, silver pieces. I'll cover the rest. Oh, and I will right. use my silver, my five silver to order extra food <laughs> and drinks. Extra bacon for you. So yeah. such, such a wholesome group here. Oh, I'm going to pay for you. Oh, it's fine. Okay, let's go. I'll get more food. <laughs> you always need more food. Is, is there a woman walking table from table selling flowers? I want a flower. <laughs> uh, make a perception check. Oh, dude, I was joking. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Hey, thanks to Mara. I already, what, what I already is yeah. there. That's a There's four. A generosity. You don't need That's to a give four. It to me, That's you know? a four. I am in the city, man. I have no idea what's happening. Yeah. You, you even if there was one, you wouldn't recognize her as selling it. Alright. Dumb little gnome. Got it. So we go down to a table eating or Usually all bacon and beer. Morning. What? Morning bacon. bacon. I mean, uh, bacon. I assume if everyone wants to gather like at a table, you can uh, have breakfast. Yeah. We'll have the usual B&B. B&B. and b b and b Beer and bacon. Bacon and b Beer and bacon. Beer and bacon. <laughs> b and b No? Could yeah. be bacon and beans yeah. if you want to. Yeah. It's uh, easy provided. You guys eat up. <clears throat> you can chat on your next step. At some point, Sildor comes down along with... Uh, Am Darren. Darren. And uh, they sit down with you guys. They look rough. Probably didn't really slip well, but they're here. Bye. Good you morning. do look rough. Did you sleep well? I uh, can't really say I did. But I mean, how come? Uh, I mean, it's a great place. Uh, new city, new sounds. When you get hold like me. This light thing just rock your night. Oh, yeah. Uh. Plan today so, is fine. I slept very well. I, uh, I had a long chat with a very hot orc. And then I went to bed and slept like a baby. <laughs> okay. And I wake up and... Uh, Friend pays my room. This is a great day. Great day indeed. What do we do today, actually? Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> um, well, we we can go to the Lord's Alliance. 
try to recruit some uh, help for Fendelin. Yeah, about that. That might be not the main reason why we're here. Oh, okay. What, what, what would be the main reason then? I look around to see if we're spied on. If someone is looking at us. Make your perception check. Can I perceive? Uh, we all perceive. I got a unnatural 20. <laughs> 18? A, a math 20. Uh, you looking around? No, nothing seems unusual. You you spot a uh, like a child that seems to not have his hands in his pocket. So uh, you might want to check, like watch your purse. But other than that, nobody's suspicious or looking at you weird. All right. Well, actually, we might be uh, <clears throat> looking for the uh, main reason why your town was so in a bad shape, which were who were pulling the strings. And I watch the rest of the group and kind of feel the vibe to see if they know where I'm getting at, if they approve of me talking about it or something. Yeah, I think that the web Tickens. Uh, um, yeah, have you heard of the Black Spider? Have we ever talked about that guy in the Black Spider? We talked yeah. about it. Did we? And that's Many Ender, times. Ender Matt. Yeah, so that's kind of our main concern. If you try to recruit people now, you might get infiltrated by Black Spider members and it could start over again. But maybe but, that the Lord Alliance knows stuff also. Yeah. And maybe that's shady why deals. I need info on them. I'm guessing maybe the Lord's Alliance could be infiltrated as well. We don't know shit about the Black Spiders. I fuck out. Yeah, we can try to be the heroes and stop a uh, cruel illegal business. <laughs> Yeah, and they're bad. They're a bad bunch. But this is why we're here. Or so your recruitment efforts could be uh, maybe a front. You know, as a trap. You know, as a as a way to attract Black Spider members and maybe get them to think they can infiltrate us. But in reality, we would watch them very closely. Mm hmm. Guys. Maybe put out some fake info. I fake I thought you guys were you were trying to find uh like find the location of the the cave. I, I'm I'm also. I'm that's kind of an I'm, why, I'm I stuck with you guys because you you said you wanted to come with me to my friend to ask him. Yeah. 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 yeah that too. It was, it's just that we don't really care about recruiting, really. We have we have a lot on our plates. Yeah. We so should we leave now? The dangerous people who could be infiltrating your ranks in your little recruitment effort if you do not care. If you're not careful. Right. So you could you could always do it, but. Yes, I'm warning you, you'd be screwed, probably. Maybe dead when you come back. Something bad could happen during the travel back. Or even worse, over there. You could take over the whole town. I mean, depending on the numbers, that's a powerful organization we're talking about here. But then, if recruiting is not a priority, what is it? I just told you. Find the black spider. But to find America. the black spider, we need to find the cave. Oh, is that is that what this is about? 
I thought the cave was like a magical place, medical with loot and stuff. Well, it's the whole... pretty much tightly woven. Oh, and let's find the cave. <laughs> I step up and I put some bacon in my mouth and... What are you waiting for? Let's go. I thought you were going to say, put some bacon in my beer. That, well... There might be some traces of it. <laughs> it all it all goes to the same place in the end. <laughs> Eventually. I, I, I move when I walk beside the little kid who steals stuff. I just like slapping on the back of the head. Pretty <laughs> bad. He's like, oh, I I'm not doing anything. Do you force him? No. <laughs> he's like, he's looking around like at all of you guys, the, the whole lot. That he's just <laughs> and looks very scared and start like walking very fast at, to the exit and leaves. <coughs> all right. I think we scared him. Nah, we didn't. All right, let's, uh, I say we go to the Lord's Alliance first. Then, uh, I'm still going to look for some armor smith on the way, if possible. The guy we saw yesterday had decent stuff, but not, not, not for a guy my size. Is there any other thing we need to... Uh, like uh, supply our equipment before we leave it's probably our best bet in the city to find whatever we need before we leave for either the cave or thunder tree well if I look at the map we're gonna have to kind of come back in never winter after thunder tree so we can always pop back in the shop and see if we miss something or think about it. Or yeah. get an order. Th Thunder, Tree. Thunder Tree is not the most safe place either, but I I'm just saying, like, since we're here, I don't know if uh, you guys wanted to wait for your order before we left for Thunder Tree. Or if we can leave today after going to the Lord, Lord's Alliance, or we make it kind of a shopping day, so tomorrow we can pick up your saddle and leave. Shopping spree and... sounds good. Well, the saddle is already. No, it would making, be ready tomorrow. Right? Yeah. Oh. Um. I mean, I could spend the rest of the day looking for uh, armors. So we could Shit. leave tomorrow oh. with uh, my newly new new backpack. We, we can also um, buy new new stuff and uh, you know keep an eye out for uh, information about the black spider. The market is bound to have a, a lot of people in it. So we are not going to the alliance? I don't know, I'm just giving an option. Well... Why we cannot go to the lower alliance today? No, we can. Okay. I don't want to. <laughs> <laughs> it would be easy if we go and then we go shopping. I mean, they already kind of know. Uh, like, I, I started sending letters and stuff like that. There might be already, like, people that are assigned to come with us already. I don't know. Like, le sending letters is not the most co convenient way to communicate. But 
They are aware I am coming. Well, so we can go. Maybe they they uh, they have already like men's ready. I don't know. All right, let's go. Lead the way, Saldor. All right. So you guys finish your breakfast and your beer. You uh, start walking to the Lord's Alliance headquarters following Sildor. Um, takes about like 40 minutes from where you are. Um, when you arrive, it's kind of a... Like it, it's not like a, a castle. It's more of a kind of a mansion, but it's all in uh, like stone work. So it, it's kind of the feeling of a castle, but it's still not uh, that big. Like a barrack? Yes, exactly like a barrack. Nice. And uh, you arrive, there's like people around uh, outside that seem to be armed uh and yeah you 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 guys can just walk in sildar is leading uh he's greeting some people that he knows uh as he walks by uh the like there's a, a main room that open there are like equipments on this uh, on the side or some like uh desk uh and there's like a, a door that opens to kind of a, a courtyard. So there's kind of an open space in the middle. Um, and you see like people kind of training. There's dummy and uh, like target to practice. It's really a uh, melee range, uh, like fighting kind of organization that uh, seems to be working there uh so sildar makes his way to uh one of the desks to uh the guy and announce himself hey i'm sildar i think you got some uh probably letters from me i don't know if i can talk to To Pimerick. Pimerick? <clears throat> and uh, Pimerick. And uh, the other uh, respond. Yeah, he's in the, uh, he's the in the courtyard. He's just training the newbies. You can go see him. And uh, so you guys make your way to the courtyard. So there's some people train. Tell me, Sir Lord, who who is this? Pimerick. It's Pimerick. Uh, Marbladu. He's an old friend of mine. Um, he's a... Damn it. I forgot his... Uh... He's a war duke. He's one of the highest rank in the Lord's Alliance. He's my superior. That's who I address the letters. Come in and get kind of help in Fendelin. All right. That just came into my mind, but. Wasn't uh, the other face guy that you left with? Uh, what was his name? Yarno. Wasn't Yarno part of the Lord's Alliance also? He was indeed. Not our best. Um... Not, not our best memory, if I could say. Because I had uh, to do a full report on him. But yeah, we thought 
him to be lost without him to be like in the hands of the enemy but turns out he was the enemy yeah that's why i'm kind of uh it's when him i talked at breakfast about the infiltrators i mean it kind of happened before be on our watch then we shall hopefully hopefully it didn't reach here all right so you guys make your way to the courtyard um uh, Sildar is greeted by uh, Pimrick and they just like have a bit accolade uh they share some like uh, small talk I, uh, how have you been oh i've been great yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh nice. it's good to see you like you got in fat you big guy <laughs> the kind of uh bro talk just, yeah yeah um and he 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 turns to you guys uh and he said like this is the the group that have been helping in funneling they actually saved my life more than once now and they have been like a huge help uh in our cause they are called the hey the were damage control control at a post <laughs> <laughs> like the green new uh, in dragon ball z yeah. yeah. Yeah, exactly. Nice. <laughs> uh, Primrick, just look at you. Like, he's not sure. It doesn't sound serious for for him, but um, he greets every one of you. Hello, I'm Primrick. I'm the, I'm the war duke here in, uh, in um, Neverwinter. I've received a missive from Sildar. Um, we can dispatch two of our Ren Knife here to Fendelin as kind of commander of the army. I can present them to you, uh, but if you need more, we will have to put out some, we have put some signs, but uh, the recruitment has been low. So we would need help to gather more so that we can set an actual um, like militia in Fendelin. Right. Well, how, how did you say that? To what knight? Red knife. Red knife. Red knife. They are kind of a a, gra a grade a uh, a rank above just soldier. They should be perfect to just put some structure in Fendelin. As right now, there's only Sildar and a few soldier. So I don't know how you guys wanted to pro proceed uh if you guys are here in the city for some time you could help with the recruitment or um uh, we're still in the work so we we can take care of it but surely if there we have some help it could speed up the process putting oh, banners dude. well putting banners and like ads isn't really giving us a good turnaround like, we have to we need you yeah exactly with the... need with... you with with this the sign of the lord of alliance but we 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 need more like involves strategies we need to go around 
and like ask people directly, find the right people that are maybe in need of a fresh start or just not having a good direction in life or like it's up to your imagination really there's a lot of people in this city needs help protecting ancient treasure ancient treasure is there treasure in Fenelan Sildor that you didn't tell me about yeah, once they're in Fenelan and they realize it was all a hoax I mean what else is there to do then Subscribe. I like how you think that's exactly the kind of mentality we need right now. Yeah. Maybe not an ancient treasure. Well, you know, you get this, you get the marketing aspect, right? You just pay them, make them believe in final end. Yeah. We've tried, we've tried many different slogan or like phrase. Didn't really bring much. How about this? Candidates. I heard there's an empty castle not far from there. Up with the grab, right? So maybe you could do a rap. Excuse me? I mean rap over the castle. Big brain. You, you call it you call it Anlin's Raffle Castle. Castle Raffle. We need you. I'm like this. I'm not good at marketing. Mostly, you know, dealing with dead stuff. That's a good idea. If you want to try, I, I can show you the desk uh, where we have someone dealing with, like, those kind of papers. Uh, we can try it. I don't know if it's gonna work, oh, but I mean, it's worth a try. This castle right now, we could just the town could seize the territory and write up a deed for it, and that could be legit. What's the shape of that castle? Destroy. Silver. Right. All and right. Nobody knows uh, it. I mean, it's, it's pretty. Cell. Still pretty usable. You just need a roof over it and rebuild the of the walls. You know, oh, it's, it's a, it's a, a fixer upper. Yeah, yeah, a third, a, a third of the project. castle is still standing. The other third and is probably burnt. We fucking it's, it's, cleaned the shit. Yeah, yeah, it's land. It, land is good. I mean, it's, you can get, if you don't take it, I will. I'm gonna make a great temple. There is a temple already. And it, now it's still Dar talking because very not very good with those two voices. Uh, well, I mean, it's fine to give it for the purpose of the city, but if you want to just claim it, I don't think it's going to be that easy for yourself. I mean, and but castle. yeah. Now that you think about it, there's a shrine in it. I don't think I can allow anyone to take it. But I do have to protect it, though. Nah, that's a bummer. Maybe the town should just take it. It's nobody's castle. And it's still a temple. I'm gonna make it my temple. Well, a temple. Or the found the land. We need men to guard that. I, I, I don't think you can just take it. For yourself, I mean. For the city, that it's a good bullshit. idea. Who's gonna you stop him? Well, <laughs> nobody, I mean, nobody fucking cared about that castle and saying we came in and we cleaned that shit up. It was abandoned. It's our castle. It's our castle. It's our castle. And I'm going to sit somewhere near. Or just <laughs> like angry. I got myself angry. Excuse him. He gets rock worked up sometimes, but he's a good guy. Um. It's damage controls castle. So yeah. about the recruitment, is there any other idea, or you guys want? Yeah, I, we'll I call can... it DCC. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Um, I can show you to the two guy that I've selected. If you want, you can make it up a plan for the recruiting with them. Sure. All right. So you right. start walking in, uh, in, in kind of the mansion. Um, takes a, a few minutes. You reach a like common room where there's tables and people eating. Um, at, like every time he walks in the room, like everyone stands up and makes like a, a salute. Um, he walks to two guys that are sitting together. Here's Domin, Reto, and Elisar Araxina. They are good guys. I want to say that uh, I, everyone <laughs> that saluted, Zook saluted back. <laughs> It's been military, so it doesn't know such, you know, fun point. <laughs> Good. Uh, yeah. Uh, Dubbin is a, a ranger, and Alessar is a fighter, so he should be able to. They, they, both, they both should be able to uh, train new guys with, like, a sword or a bow. Good, get a good mix up in in your newly formed small army and provide structure and direction. So, guys, that's the that's Sildar that I talked to you and his group of people that have been helping him. They can't stay in Fendelin always. So they need a more um, permanent solution to keep the city safe. There's so people that is that is training already in uh, Fendelin. So they going to support the people and train them. Too? Yeah, they're gonna help uh, with the. The training basically yeah okay. we're trying to inform up someone who really can stand up against the evil organizations especially eight legged ones legged, yeah legged legged play eight eight legged a good one yeah what yeah mm -hmm. so Currently in Fendelin, and now it's still there, Taki. Currently in Fendelin, we don't have a lot. Um, we were able to recruit a couple, but uh, there's a few that gave up. We lost two in the last battle with the beast that came up in in the town. That's right. So, Ooh, the so now oh, I remember now. We have. I don't know. <clears throat> maybe two. Uh, maybe three, four guards left. Maybe we don't want to mention that beast. It's a one-time thing. However, there's someone crafting beasts who are attacking Final Land. Why the fuck would they do that? Oh. There's nothing there. It's a shit all of, shit all of a town. Why would they craft trillion golds worth of, of beasts and just send in them? I and try to bitch. look if someone is <laughs> listening to that. Who in their right minds would do that? It's like, oh shit. Somebody who doesn't like us, probably. Is it us? Is it us? We should stay here and wait if beasts come and attack. Okay. I'm not sure it's a good idea. But it would be kind of good death. If we're not in Fendalin and nothing happened, we just don't have to go. Well, and if something happened, they're probably all going to die. Yeah. Hey, that's a risk I can yeah, yeah. take. <laughs> yeah, but at least 
can't say risk no we're willing to take. Well, it's supposed to be that they are warriors. They live for this. Right? What? It's no, supposed I'm, to be. I'm talking about right now. Oh, okay. If something happened right now, or if we wait before well, we send like more, guards, right? A few, but with a beast like that coming again, Honestly, the few that are that there, if we're not there. I mean, us as a group, is we're so good. <clears throat> you're screwed anyway. So, I mean, could it be that you need us to be there? Well, they kind of need someone to protect them at some point. Yeah, but fuck, I'm not the fucking mayor of Van Lynn. Well, the mayor also town. needs protection. I got a castle. I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a lord now. I don't need no shit-ass town. Certainly do, not a mayor. Do we have to call you Lord Kragma now? Is the, is the castle no, near the village? Lord <laughs> uh, no. Lord no. Dune. <laughs> How about they sell you the village? Now you have an incentive to um, protect it. Yeah, eventually they become my peasants and... Yeah, well, and even the castle around. that you're talking about is in the city. So if you're the lord kind of the of. castle, you're the lord of the city. I'm just a... It's still your city. If it goes to castle. shit because of the like monster, the, then the you don't have a city and you don't have a castle. A and you're castle, lord of nothing. A, a temple. I, it's just going to be a very, very nice temple <clears throat> where I live and I have servants. In we, the city we, we're we, talking we. to protect. Yeah, I'll, I'll protect my temple. <laughs> <laughs> this This conversation is going nowhere. Yeah, I think we're, we just looped around right now. Hey, I could just get myself a temple. Talking about caves. <laughs> yeah, what about the cave? We are looking okay. for information about a cave. And, um, I, I'm sorry. Like, uh, you're going to have to be more precise. They're not streaming. I'm sorry. I'm, he's not there. <laughs> the way they go cave. <laughs> At cave. Um, the wave echo cave. Okay. The wave echo okay. Oh wow! I thought you were all doing it at the same time, but it was just a man. <laughs> and like, uh, Primic is like just giving a uh, like just a look at uh, Sildar. He's not too sure what you guys are like referring to and you just look weird at this point he, he starts getting uncomfortable weird um, but powerful he's like all right um so Dumman elizar i leave that test to you you are now responsible for the town you find your guys and you move there with the help of Simat and this group if they are willing all right i have other stuff i need to get back to so i'm gonna go Oh, hey, wait, you know about this Black Spider organization? No clue. Bye. Oh, and fuck. He, he's dying. We lost what his interest. Here? <laughs> hey, are you a member of the... Uh. Uh, so you just, out. right now, you're just like yeah, standing in front of the, the two other guys yeah. and just staring. How, how tall are they? Uh... Oh, yeah. Average eight hates. They are both humans. Hmm. I'm a bit taller than them, then. Yes. Okay. <laughs> uh, I start talking with the ranger about. Yeah, uh, I'm just boat. gonna go with. Uh, so, uh, tell me, <clears throat> Dooman, and I'm gonna stay like as close as I can possibly can, so they kind of have to like look up. <laughs> <laughs> so tell me, Dooman, and. Uh, <laughs> I'll step to Alisar. How long have you been in Lord Alliance, son? Well, it's been five years for me and six for Alisar. And it's dumb and talking. Fair enough. I'll step back. <laughs> okay. They've, they've been and there for a while, so... Anything else that 
you guys need from us? We are searching for uh, information about <clears throat> a cave. We need the location. Do you know uh, someone uh, that we can talk? Well, I think at this point, the, the cave is probably going to be in Thunder Tree. We're going to have some answers, but if you know okay. anything about the Black Spiders or any organization that could go with it. Or the Echo Cave? Uh, all that you guys are talking about, I have no idea. Mm. Like, I'm here. We we are both here to try and recruit people and move to Fenderlin so that the city is safe. And that is our main priority right now. Um, I think the dwarf had some ideas that we can apply. Other than that, we are going to need to go like just walking around the city and try to recruit people mm. that we think could be interesting. So you guys can help or... Like there is libraries in the town, like that's stuff you can research, but like we don't have stuff about caves and we don't know what the the red sp spider is or whatever. Fair enough, fair enough. And did you start recruiting yet? Oh, it's well, going. We have uh, we have started like putting out ads and stuff like that. Uh, I think Pimrick probably gave uh, at least this information to you guys, but for now it, it has turned out maybe one or two drunk guy uh, in their like fifties. Um, Inside check the drunk guy. <laughs> Are they here? D the tr the no. Oh, <laughs> I was we had to. They they couldn't like hold a, a sword right and shoot a bow, so we have to we had to turn them down. So yeah, just posting like stuff is not working. That's why I'm I'm saying that our next step is going to go and do more active re recruiting. Um, we've not been assi assigned to this. Uh, task for a long time so uh, this like the stuff with the ads and all that was done before us now uh, we are actively working on it so we were gonna start like today so cool. you guys are free to tag along or uh, if good. you want to try a different type of ad with some incentive uh, that could be helpful um, but other than that, we're going to go on our way. Yeah, you seem doing good. Continue like that. Th thanks for your, your appreciation. If we find someone, we'll send we, we, them We can your help way. putting posters. There is posters or something? like. Yes, there is a... I can point you to... Uh, like we, we have someone that... The poster man. You could call it that... Not in his, not in his face, please. That would be rude. But um, uh, we have a a room with paper and uh, ink and people that knows how to write that can do some posters. So uh, if you have cool ideas, I can show you the room and have a talk with with them. Paper, you say? Well. I go with you. I'm going for the posters. We we need some information, so uh, in the way to the library, I think we can just give some posters. Okay. Sure. Well, I mean, uh, it, it's going to take some time to create the poster, but you can talk with the guy to if you have an idea I, to I make want them. This. Okay. Right, but it, it, he's not a machine. He has to work on them. Okay. So. All right, follow it? me. And, okay. Uh, he he start making your way to uh, like around some corners, and uh, you reach a, a room. Uh, he opens the door. There's a a, a guy in in there. It's a, a it's a gnome. 
he has like a a cap on his head and like there's paper everywhere on on the floor and uh it, it's very messy uh he's in at his uh, like table and he's just like drawing and and writing on paper he <laughs> as soon as you open the door he raises his head yeah what we need some posters yeah Possibly. i do posters yeah, that's what I do. Okay. What do you need? We are recruiting people <clears throat> to to protect Fendalin. Yeah, we did those. We did those. Here. Did those? I made like five five or ten more of these. And like he has a, a pile. You can uh, look at it. Um, How it looks. Just, it's like uh, the, the sign of the Lord's Alliance. Uh, with like join the force, save the city, uh, and Fendelin is written like um, in small underneath. It's not very flashy. It's just yeah, um, not a good design. <laughs> Have you thought about Fendelin is the new Neverwinter? <laughs> oh, oh, that's good. That's good. And he starts like taking notes. <laughs> Always summer? Uh, no. I mean... Yeah. I'll work the on other it. One, the other guy is better. Work for Fendelin or we'll get you? There will mm. be some reward. more aggressive? <laughs> A bit too aggressive, I would think. Oh. There is cool we want girl. to... <laughs> this... What? Yeah, there, there is... Cute girls and... I don't know. <laughs> There's cute girls in Fendelin, and you never tell me. Uh, yeah. Uh, what's the what's the ad again? Um, there is. Give me a sec. <laughs> the beer in Fendelin <laughs> is to <laughs> die for. There is a castle. Oh, your, I'm trying something. Your first one and your first one was better. Mm. Anything else? And you were adventures from adventurers. I got it. I got it. The what? Everyone, everyone step back. Okay. I got it. Oh I you single Sorry. girls in your area. <laughs> 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 Isn't Fendelin Isn't four days away? It's the, the area. I mean, we never specified how big the area it's is. It's the closest town there is. Yeah, uh, yeah. Hungry uh. for adventure? Ooh. Samad gets it. That's a good one. I'll take a note too. Any the idea on the design? The more interesting you can do. Well, all my designs are interesting. No Any specifics? More, uh, okay, I start to looking around if I see posters, interesting posters. Make a perception check. <laughs> Honestly, I don't really know shit about what's special on Tandalan. It's kind of a... Hot girls? I mean, it's kind of I a just dead said it. town, if you know what I mean. <laughs> new new in. new beginnings in Fendelins. I think for the new one in Fendelins. Yeah, with the cute innings. girls, you could probably like put them like on a pile of gold. Because they have a lot oh, yeah. of minerals, gold. Yeah. yeah. Cute rich girl single in, in Fendelin's area. area. Yeah. In, uh -huh, that's good in Fendelin's in Fendelin's area. area. You know? I think we're getting to something now. Okay, so I like th there's that one, and there's the um, the new beginnings in Fendelins. But you know, I like the cute girl one. So I'm spent. Yeah. <laughs> what was the first one you said, Alex? Uh, <laughs> Fendelin is the new Neverwinter. 
Never winter, never heard of it. Fendelin's the new height. <laughs> oh, come on. It's a little bit funny. No? Yeah, it's always <laughs> summer. Uh, didn't someone say that? It's always summer. Yeah. Yeah. It's always it's summer. summer in Fendelin. New bikini with cute girls. <clears throat> All right. I think we're... Uh, oh, yeah. Getting nowhere, but I got some good ideas. I think I can draft some new poster. The application are gonna flow in. Okay. So now, where is the library? Uh, what? Yeah, we need we we need to go to the library. Where it is? I don't fucking know. I okay. almost never get out of my office. Okay, whatever. Just have work. Get out. <laughs> you didn't say thanks, motherfucker. <laughs> I'm no. helping you. Okay, oh. thanks. Could I? Before You're we leave, can, us. Your hand can I? Can I? Oh. Yeah, he's right though. You're helping Fendel. Could Fendel I get a couple <laughs> stacks of papers? If I get some ideas, I could. I could bring you. Uh, Stuff. Yeah, take all the paper. Ideas. Pictures. Yeah. It is parchment, it's right? Expensive. Yeah, it is parchment. All right. all right, we gave you great ideas. I'm pretty sure we're going to find more ideas right now because we we're talking about going to market and, uh, you know, inspiration. So, you know what? Give us a, give us a couple uh, stacks there and uh, we'll write down ideas. How's that? I have unused paper there. Like, I use one side, you can pick it. All right. I'll take as many as I can. And leave. All right. <laughs> so, you have a, a a stack of partially used paper. Oh, they're partially used. I didn't it's, it's kind of, like, drafted, okay. like, sketches mm -hmm. and stuff. Like, one side of the page might not be used, but the other one is, and, like... Ah, uh, alright. So, Kindle, basically, is what you're telling me. Okay. <laughs> Can take notes. I mean, yeah, I guess so. I'm good. Let's burn this town to the ground. <laughs> alright, so, um... Daman leaves you, uh... Leaves you there, like uh, he has things to do, so he, he he left. So you guys are pretty much in the the hall of uh, the headquarters right now. People but going about their business. Before we split with uh, Alisar, is he already gone? Uh, well, you you can grab him just before he leaves if you have something to ask him. Yeah, I don't want to grab him. Like grab him. I just want get his attention yes okay uh you don't know any uh good armor smith that could supply uh, armor for a guy my size uh good yeah we have a we have a, a supplier uh for well i mean they are pretty much the the biggest uh place for all equipment both the the guard of the city and uh, that's where we go also um the price is a bit expensive but they have good stuff uh it's not too far from here it, it's called the uh it's called the white clocks armory White looks armor. You have directions. Um. Well, yeah, and he gives you the directions. You are here. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Elzar. Where is the library? And uh, keep an eye on the new recruits, just to make sure they're from good seeds. Yeah. 
I'd love to take an eye out on him, but we have no recruits for now. Yeah, I was Absolutely talking about none. futures. No idea where you're gonna look. It's your target. Inns, mainly. Place where people that need a fresh start How about usually are. Missionary gangs or something. Like, uh, someone you could buy off or. Yeah, mercenary. Well, mercenaries have never been making good Lawrence Alliance candidate. Well, it's your job, so you know best. I do. Uh, if you see no. people who would be interested in you know, a more religious path, my name is uh, Simath Un, and I'm with the Church of Calamvor. You can see me. Or just go directly to the church, and they'd take a message for me. Duly no. Good to know. Yeah. If I... What, what should I be looking for exactly? Just people with the... Would like to have a more of a religious calling. Just protecting a town or something is not as relevant to them and doesn't join them as much. Maybe they will recognize themselves in a new guidance. And are they going to tell me or I need to infer that? Both. Okay. I mean, it's your job. Uh if it's an interest, um, I mean, you could put it on posters and whatnot. You could, uh, you know. You I'll keep it, it in mind. Some of the other recruits, uh, you could ask well, what's, what's most important for them. And if they talk about religion, then you know where to guide them. Doesn't mean that they can't be part of the city's authority. I get what you mean. It's I'll keep that, that in mind. I want to build a religious cult or something. Just that Templars is a thing. Inquisitor is a thing. And there's a lot of zombies in that front. I've, I've met a lot of zombies over there. So maybe they're interested in killing some. Or just seeing some. Wait, Und wait. Undead stuff as well. Just you mean there's undead stuff in Fendelin? Uh, not, uh, not in Fendelin. Actually... Not not in Finland. Just we, we we needed to get off track a bit. A few days off track. Right. But okay. we, you would never know. I mean, you could attract some people. I'm just giving you leads to sell. You know. I don't think undead is a big selling point, but I think I get what you mean. Well, it's part of an adventure, right? We're selling on adventure, so. Well, just in Finland, we've we've got a fair share of stories. You know, tell me, let me tell you. Yeah, sounds very sounds like a very busy place, from what I've heard. But the beer mm. is good. A lot of history. The beer is good. That's yeah. that's re that's a good point. That's a really good point. To the that's White Claw Armory. All right. Uh, white cloak. I said white claw. Let's go. Uh, all That's right. Cool. So you guys uh, make your way to using the information given to you by. Uh, I'm, I suck with <laughs> names. By Alisar. Alisar. It's my name. That I, I I I did that to myself. Been there, done that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, using the direction that Alisar gave you, uh, you make your way to the White Cloaks Armory. Uh, and yeah, it's uh, in a bit like higher um, standing place compared to the other M armory that you went. Like, it's very big, it's all in stone. There's a uh, like bay window with uh, armors. Some of the armors like are encrusted with gems. Like it seems very uh, fancy. There are 
uh, a lot of uh, like guards around and our uh, guards coming in and out uh it's a more like busy place of the town with more upstanding people um it's like uh a minstrel singing song uh on the side and uh some street food that seems a lot like better than just like meat and skewer um but yeah you you make your way to uh, the white cloaks um armory you may enter if you wish yes Casting i wish detect to magic. enter all right so uh you enter uh, inside um there is not a lot of um like equipment on the floor per se um <clears throat> but there is like a counter with uh, multiple representatives so it's a big open space there it, there is some like armor stand with like fancy armor on the uh on the floor and then the big counter with representatives that are uh, addressing clients so it looks like more like a jewelry store for armor than an actual armory that you would see see the armors like close up -ish. yes okay i'll go talk to a sale person <laughs> all right so you walk to uh he, he greets it's, it's just uh, a, an elf. He greets you. Hey, how may I help you? Morning. Good do morning. You, what kind of uh, armor do you have that is uh, a little bit better than a chainmail? Oh, uh, we have a lot of armor. Well, I mean, what exactly are you looking for? Because what do you mean by better than a chainmail also well what i'm looking for is basically it's a splint armor but were you looking for a something that was worked on by our like arcanists to make it even better or you're looking for just scale mail uh well, I'd be interested to see both. And actually, it all depends on the price of it. Uh, all right. It, it really depends on what type of uh, enchantment that you're looking for. And uh, like the quality, if you, have, you, you want any sort of uh ornaments gems interested in it no There's i don't i don't want any jewelry you... on my armor very fancy it, it's gonna be put at the test it's it's not for a display okay and um looking at your size you might need to have it made on order what do you mean looking on at my the... size well um you 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 are a very strong man, a very large man. Uh, I can check what we have in stock, but uh, it, it 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 might might require uh, some adjustments. Let me let me go check what I have on uh, straight scale mail. And uh, he, he goes back uh, to the shelves, just bring back like uh, a huge uh, quick uh, quick ledger. note. It's a splint. What I've said is a splint, oh, splint because sorry. scale mail is slightly different. I don't think scale mail is actually good for me. No. Checks is uh, going to be difficult. What? Tell chicks. Even oh, yeah, I'm always at disadvantage. Okay. Already. 
All right, so I think looking here, we might have something that would fit you uh, at around uh, 215 gold piece. Uh, did you bring it uh, back? No, they're just looking in their books. Uh, is it possible to see the the actual armor? Oh, oh, but of course, yes. And uh, he kind of like uh, snap his finger. And there's a girl that comes in. Uh, he points like to the book, the like this one. Uh, she kind of just like grab your arm to like bring you along. Yeah, right. Yeah, you can come with me, and y you're gonna be able to uh, try it on. And like she brings you to uh, the back in the fitting room. Uh, you sit there alone for a moment, brings back, uh, like, kind of, like, a, a, a wooden chest in the room, uh, put it there and stand, be, be, like, outside. Okay. And how is the armor? It's, uh... Like, it's very good quality. It hasn't been, like, worn or anything. It's brand new. It's shiny. It's well uh, preserved. Okay. Um, can I... Um, uh, um, <clears throat> tell me, uh, little girl. Do you see the, like, gnome uh, over there? Can you bring him to me? Y yes, yes. Um, you you know if you need help, I'm I'm here to help, like tie the straps and stuff like that. Yeah, it's more much more of a arcane nature. I'm curious of. Um, okay, yeah, and I I yeah I I can do that. And she seems a bit like uh, untr like it's kind of uncommon request, but. She complies and go get Zook. Yep. Uh, so sorry, the the gentleman there he, he asked for you. Uh, yeah. Can, can can you? Yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah, yeah, I'll follow. Uh, she brings you back. Tell me, Zook. Can you tell me anything about this armor, or it's a plane? Gonna gonna cast a. Use my. Oh, I think I cast it when I went inside. So yeah, let's check it out with the tech magic. Find it uh, pinging anything. No, not this armor. This armor is uh, is plain. No magic. Good old splint. All right. Wait. Oh, take a note. What am I picking around? Well, I mean, around there, like, the on the floor itself, there's nothing. Mm -hmm. But, uh, like, if if you're looking, like, around, uh, like, in the back store, there's multiple ping, what appear, appears to be, like, the back, like, the, the basement, probably, or a floor above. Like, okay. there is multiple. Uh, uh, Nowhere things. near where I am. No, no, no. Okay. All right. All right. Um, I would actually try it on. So. And I believe it takes ten minutes to put on a heavy armor. Fun fact. Fun fact. <laughs> so you spend ten minutes with the help of Zook or the girl. <laughs> Uh, the girl. She probably knows yeah. a bit nice. more about that. <laughs> so the girl still, still, still confused why Zook is just like standing there looking. Uh, she helps you. Uh, it takes less time with her help to uh, try it on. So in about like five minutes, you're able to get it to to fit you. It's a bit tight, but you can make it work. Okay. For it gold. would be it would be more uh, 
comfortable to have it like adjust a little bit, but uh, it's functional. Okay. Okay. It's two fifteen. What I said. Oh, sorry. I said uh, rolled on fifty. Well, our I'll, dignity I'll... level just went down, down, down. The what? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so, right. what is, I'll, what I'll is thank the girl and I'll get back uh, out to the salesman. You're what? Taking the girl? Yeah, thanking. Say thank you. Oh thank you. Oh, thank you. I'll I'll give her uh I don't know, a silver piece. Oh thank you. And uh she goes back like wherever she's from. <laughs> she goes back she's... into the shadows. <laughs> she's flirting. <laughs> uh you, you can make a perception check. Yeah, of course. Uh, not perception, insight. Inside, uh, 13. Uh, it's not that <laughs> she's very not, she's really not hard to read. Uh, oh. she's just, she's just like, uh, uncomfortable oh. and a bit scared of him. Okay. You better be. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So Fern, what are you doing? Um, to the library. Uh, do you take trade-ins? I asked to the salesman. Um, it's not a practice that we usually do. Um, what would you be trading in for? Gold? Gems? Gems could do. Um, no, it was more like if I take the splint mail, but I don't have the 215. If I give you some other piece of equipment, weapons. If the, that would the, compensate for the few gold it, I, I miss. It depends. I would have to inspect those uh, weapons. We, we're not really much in the business of pawning. We're more in like selling brand new stuff. Our clientele uh, comes here to, <laughs> to buy br brand new. Uh, so if I'm buying stuff from you, it would be just for the material. Get it smelt down and... Uh, Built new stuff, so um, we we can have a look. I don't know uh, if it's gonna shave a lot of of the price, though. Mm. All right, all right. Um, I'm gonna sleep on it. All right, but don't put the box back too far away. Uh, uh, sorry, you're gonna have to remove it first. Didn't I remove it? I didn't say you I removed did. it. <laughs> oh, sorry. It fits me so well, I forgot I had it. I'll go, I'll go back to it. She calls the girl, he calls the girl back. <laughs> she comes back. It's even more awkward. <laughs> she helps you remove it uh, about five minutes. And uh, you're off. All right. I'll see you tomorrow. Not the girl, the Lit. salesman. <laughs> 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 yes. See you soon. Thank you. And he start like working with another client. Mm -hmm. At the moment well, we get out, like. I start to asking, where is the library? <laughs>
to every peasant. Okay. <laughs> you, uh, what is the language? You, you're just shouting or? No, Make I'm like, a... I'm like stopping someone in. Where is the library? <laughs> Make a persuasion or intimidation check. Whatever you're feeling what? like. Uh, that doesn't even work. Okay. Okay. Uh, 14 for persuasion. Persuasion. Oh no, shit. I don't have what? anything in persuasion. So 12, 12, 12. Persuasion still? Yeah. Uh, so yeah, you're like you you find some random people uh, in the street, uh, just asking like, "Where's the library?" And they're like, "Oh, um, you're new in town, right?" Yeah. Uh, I, the library is not too far from here. It's uh, um, it's quite common. It's a very big building. You can't miss it. It's like two street that way. Hey, thank you. But I stop you... just walking. Okay. <laughs> so to the library, we need information. <laughs> you say we we walk in formation. <laughs> we yes. need information. Okay, we need information. The flying goose. The <laughs> flying goose. Um, or the plow. So sure. at the moment we get we get there, uh, I suppose I can enter freely. I suppose. Um, there is like representative uh, at the at the door. Um, it's like it's not like an open space that you you can uh, enter. Like, um, when you pass the door, there's someone that asks you, um, hello. hello, good morning, Hi. what can I do for you? Uh, we are searching information about a cave. What is the name of the cave? Wavico Cave. cave. Wavico cave. 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 So, oh. <laughs> we need the location of this cave. Do you know if I can found this information here? There's a lot of information that can be found in this establishment. Uh, the books here are very precious, so you will need someone uh, to help you in your research and, uh, and uh, also to make sure that uh, the, the book doesn't go uh, missing. Oh, there is okay. a f there is a fee for the the person per per hour. Uh, How much it is? It is uh, two gold per hour. Damn. Damn. I'm gonna That's sit this one knowledge. out. Wow. Well, Maybe. if you. There is uh, memberships or other deal that are um, available, or you can be referred by someone uh, that could prove your identity or prove your uh, goodwill, if you say. But Seldor is with us? With, uh, no, Seldor stayed at the Lord's Alliance. Nice. Oh, how about one gold? Uh, you would have to negotiate with uh, the monk. Oh. Okay, I just need the location. If the monk works well, well, maybe I'm going to pay the two gold. And yeah, if he can find them in one hour. So yeah. So, do you want me to get you someone? Yeah, please. All right. Uh, she leaves our desk. Uh, takes about like five minutes. She comes back with someone. Um, it's a it's a half elf, uh, like short hair, 
dress like normally with a tunic and a brown pants um you're 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 and he just um addressed you tamara you're the one that uh required the a scribe for yes, of course. your research yes nice yes. to meet uh, you it, it, it's very nice to meet you it's uh, great to see people interested in history and uh the knowledge that we have in uh, our books here yeah oh i am paying for an hour for this just go and i just push him like i did that location all right uh so he, he takes the gold um bring uh is it just you or everyone is coming i'm it's not per person it's per person no, no, I'm, I'm asking. No, I wasn't going. I'm saving my gold. It's not I'm... per person. I'm oh. just saying, like, are you sitting, like, are you sitting at the table with Tamara while uh, he's like bringing books and stuff like that? Sure. In that case. Okay, it's just, it's, it's just two gold for everyone. Yeah, yes. it's okay. it's for the time. Well, it's oh, it's, okay, okay, okay. So it's for the be, guy. Uh, Nope. Uh, well, I, I don't think I'll. I'll just like for the people who leave and go in the search, uh, I'll cast. Um, uh, what what was it? Guidance on them. For the monk. For the for the the one person who has the most investigation. Okay. Who is it? It's Gabe, but he's not going. <laughs> Motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm the monk going for the book, but... Well, I was thinking, like, we are all go for the book. Well, you... Um... Got the most investigation? Well, you guys are meta gaming, so I don't... I will not exactly tell you where it's gonna go. <laughs> well, I know the monk is, is searching for the information. That was I paid two gold. The 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 monk is supervising. Is super it's just supervising. Supervising Shit. you. Okay. That's it. Okay. Okay. How much investigation I have? Okay. Plus two. Okay. Maybe I can do it. <laughs> <laughs> you have more than me. I have more than you. Oh. Yeah. That's nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So. Can do it. Tamara has more investigation than Kate? Yeah. Yeah. Interesting. So guidance. Plus one. So Simon give me guidance. Nice. Yes, so. So um so who's going? Everyone or not? Yeah, I'll follow. Going where? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's a trip. In, into the library. Yeah, into the library. library. Books. And we burn the books. No. And Simon. Mm -hmm. So is, is everyone going or not? Like, yes. 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 In the library, yes. Not looking and searching for the book. Why well, the, the guy? Time. If you're going to the library. The guy is sitting you at the table, and you stay at the table. Okay. And he bring us the books we ask. Mm. Yes, or oh, okay. related to the topic that you okay. are interested in. Caves, that cave. Way and... cave. And We're if going. there is something about the black spiders, that too. Oh. Okay. Um. <laughs> You're gonna I end up with books with about the biology. Spider, what what they're into, what's their goal? <clears throat> nothing, right? So, what's the question, Samantha? We know nothing about the black spiders, right? What's their goal? What do they want in life? What's their well? They 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 sell slave, right? Yeah, they're in slavery. Mm hmm. That's as much as I I could gather. You met them before me, but 
yeah. afterward, you know, we found flyers about Maybe them selling about slaves. The history of slavery mm -hmm. in Neverwinter. Yeah. So, books on... Especially organization. Organizations who were involved Illegal in slavery in the in or near Neverwinter. And the cave. Yeah. I want a book that is like, is she into you? <laughs> Are you you are the hero of your own book? No, no. no. Just a general book about women. <laughs> are you Let's asking that for real? Do you have magic books? Mm -hmm. I have a book on you with picture. <laughs> <laughs> the adult section is in the back right there. <laughs> All right, so, uh, he, he takes some notes on uh, your request. Uh, all right. And he, 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 he takes a, like a few minutes, go around, uh, the libraries. Um, he starts by bringing back, uh, some books on ready to like the, it, like the, uh, some just history book in the timeline of uh, when the the cave was active. Uh, some book relating wars uh, and like you might find things about the war the war that happened between the gnomes and uh, the the orcs. Uh, you get um, like just also general books about caves and famous cave and like uh it's like he brings a lot of book related to like cave and that part of history uh when that happened um and uh yeah so that's the first thing he brings back so I start searching for this cave, if there is any map or something that can uh, tell me the uh, place of this cave, where we can find it. Okay. Uh, make an investigation check. Come on. Ho ho ho, natural 20. <laughs> Don't forget no the guy. Way. That in the guidance, like <laughs> twenty four. <laughs> All right, Dude, that's cr that's, that's crazy. Uh, I don't know if I can show. Yeah, maybe I don't know. I think not. Did we do someone? No. Our camera closed. Yeah. 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 Uh -huh. closed. She pressed the button. Oh. <laughs> but yeah, I cannot. But it's a 20 plus 4. Nice. Um, so, uh, you start like looking through the books uh, about like uh, the history. Um, and like there is a lot of what you already uh, kind of heard about. But it goes in way more details about like um, uh, what the 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 gnomes and the human were doing in in the cave. What like that? There's a lot of uh, like magic in there, but uh, it kind of um, it it it. It goes into more details that like uh, the kind of stone that you can find in there can be used to infuse like uh, magic items, uh, infuse like... Uh... Could they be used as a catalyst for uh, magic? They, they might. I'm specifically so just... referring to 
the stone we found into the beast in Fenderlin. Ooh, good point. Ooh. Oh. Well, it it I I mean Fern didn't really say that to you. You're just reading right now. But okay. uh, there <laughs> there is a lot. Yeah, a lot of information on uh, the the r richness of the cave in like m magic essence, and that it can be extracted. Uh, they don't go into details of what's the form of it, but uh, this uh, this process is able to uh, help into uh, enchanting items, enchi enchanting like. Uh, animated stuff and very like things that you are not used to see uh, elsewhere are are not used to see uh, in this day and age um you find like kind of uh information on where it like it is uh in like not a map form but more like in uh in text that like the general vicinity and other towns but uh you you can't really like um like you can't really map it to a place that you could walk to directly okay so it says like ar like Near where, uh, near some knowing. So like uh, with place? with or... with um with what you recognize in the text and what you know of the area, you get a good feeling that it is not too far from Fendelin. Okay. But with you. That... With that 24, I found a map. <laughs> Maybe. Matt. There is, uh, like, there. Matt, I miss workshop here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, like, it, even with the, the 24, it, like, in the books, like, the, the cave was still lost. Like, um, the location itself in other books that you can find that confirm like that it, it is not known to the common knowledge like the the library doesn't have the information of where it is located exactly you just have a rough idea that um it is uh close to the area that you guys have been uh going around especially fendelin Okay, so I, I could say that it's near to Fendelin, in some any area near to Fendelin. Okay. Yes. Did I know that area, knowing that, that I move around the, the forest a lot? <clears throat> so I maybe I've been passing near to the cave and I never noticed? No. Okay. You're 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 pretty sure that um you haven't been close, not close enough, so that like textual form could like say like oh yeah I I, I went there. Okay. Can I know like what is the? How do I say that? Where, where is like a point that I know that they to me like, okay, the cave is near to this point. Uh, the... Basically cross-referencing well, maps. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Um... Like the only thing that you find is kind of a, a an image of the entrance. 
and it as like a uh like a, a big arch around with like sculpted uh faces of gnomes and elves Can I inspect the image with my gnome and knowledge? See if there's anything I pick up that maybe they haven't. If uh, if Tamara shares it, mm. yeah, I, sh I I share it to everyone. Is, I'm too small. No one no one can stop me. Is the password to in, to enter is melon. <laughs> it's friend in elves. Come on! <laughs> you didn't no, try I, the whole I, layout. I, <laughs> it was a good one. I'll, I'll give you that one. It was a good one. So, is there anything with my um? Like, what would I roll to to see if I'm, you know, any details she's not seeing? I could could maybe point out. Or if I can uh, realize if the entrance is something like a no, like uh, there is something near to the image that I see that uh, there is a place that I know. A mountain in the back or something? Yeah, something like that. I take a... I don't know if that exists. I'm that. more curious about the uh, the entrance. I try to take a glass and see more in detail. Mm. Like a, a magnifier? Yeah. Do you have a magnifier? Well, there is in the table something that I can use like that. Uh, they try to keep like glass of water away from the books as much as possible. The scribe oh, cannot uh, provide any? Water? No, a magnifier. Yeah, sure, if you ask, you might have one. Uh, good sir. Good. <laughs> That's not my voice at all. <laughs> 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 Can we have a magnifying glass? No. Uh, my eyes are not what they once used to be. Yeah, uh, I think I should Aren't be able you like to. Thirty-four. So as he's bringing, uh, as he's bringing like more books uh, about um, the. About like history of slave and uh, just anything about slaving around the area or what was recorded, uh, he, he he says like, yeah, I I, I think I, I can find that. Um, I'll, I'll I'll be right back. Nice. So a slavery history. <laughs> Pretty sure that's going to date a long time back. There is something about in the slavery, in the book about the slavery in history that gets related to the black spiders or some kind of name. Like, I don't know, this guy was doing this or something. Make make an investigation check. Oh, come on. No, that's all. You've been guided. Oh. This, this is not real. <laughs> I have another 20. <laughs> really? Yes. I <laughs> called and was like, it would be amazing if you rolled another 20. I can't believe this. That's your I lucky dice. again. <laughs> I'm going and to roll in crazy. the corner. Holy shit. There's only 20s on it's that It's again dice, a 20 so. and a 4. Yes. Um, give me a second. <laughs> so much knowledge. Here's, here's the address so of the black knowledge. spider. <laughs> here's everyone that in it. Here's uh, every spice that they got. Dude, well, this, this die now is my favorite. Good news what she discovered in the first book. You pinpoint her searches in the second book. <laughs> what? Like to refine this. She can use the knowledge she gained in the first book to 
Um, yeah, but they're two, to the two different one. subjects. Yeah, yeah, yeah and... she. Well, maybe there's, you know. Guide her search in the second book. Mm -hmm. Wait, I wrote for the second book. Yeah. Was it 22? Wow. Uh, I don't know if you see the die of the corner I roll. <laughs> Alright, so uh, you spend like most of uh, the rest of the hour like going through the uh, slavery books. Um, so what you find like there is uh a lot of history about like when wait like how neverwinter treated slavery in uh the history so like uh it it was at some point more common but it was kind of uh uh ban like uh ban at some point uh most of the slave in the city were uh like giving uh, either left or given a, a job and uh, at this point in time like uh, the, the slave uh, in never winter uh, the slave market is not uh, a late legal thing but then um, it starts going into like uh, the the famous houses that um, uh, add slave uh, before and uh once the ban happened those some of those houses became more like underground uh keep like some uh, uh slaves network and c continue to do uh, trading um one uh particular house and uh I, I I don't have my books. So there's one house with uh, a specific name that uh, I'll find and okay. send send to you eventually. Uh, okay. what, it was one of those houses, uh, and they've been keeping at it, having some issue with the law uh, since like the ban happened. It's been almost like a hundred years now so it's generation upon generation that they've keep that network and have been going more and more like on the ground uh, <clears throat> very powerful uh, uh, family um, help with the slave market and all that um, and uh, in one book talking about that family you find uh, like their insignia and then it there, like, seal is the drawing of a spider. Oh, nice. What's the name of the sign? Just kidding. He, he <laughs> I, can't, I can't find it, but it's going to take me a... Uh, uh... So that's is like, like, how do you call that? The arms the the inside of the family like for about years what? that house that's the the design of the family mm -hmm. right the spider yes yeah. it's like their uh, crest or how do you call that uh, a seal um, is it a seal, a seal? I mean, yeah. it's a seal crest okay okay and this family is a powerful family, if I understand. They, they, they were once like a, a powerful family, but when the breakdown from slavery, slavery happened, they started becoming more and more like um, <clears throat> underground and like criminal, but they were still powerful and still using slaves. So uh, they, they became less, they became less like uh, high ranked socially and more and more like very high profile uh, criminals still using slave and like the, mo the most um, kind of po powerful family uh, in the slave 
kind of industry around can uh, around Neverwinter. Okay. That is uh, someone's name, like. Uh... Uh, well, it, you have the name of the. A lord or something like that. Well, it's the family name of that. Ah, okay. Family. Okay. Which is. Uh... After you're going to send something. Like okay. Mm. What another question we have? Uh, oh, yeah, uh, I didn't receive my answer about the image of the entrance of the cave. Did I see something strange or something familiar? So, um, while you are, um, while you are, like, in the, uh, reading about, like, the slave and all that, like, uh, there's a long time that passed by, so at some point, uh, the guy brings uh, a magnifier. He also brings like uh, some love stories to burn. Uh, Tusk love is part of it. Nice. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm doing and Tusk love. He, al he also <laughs> brings some uh, like just uh, painting books, like just books with paintings to Kate. Um, okay. So once you're done with your slavery uh, uh, research, you you can use a magnifier to uh, look at uh, the image that you found. <clears throat> I start to look in. All right, make another investigation check. Oh shit! Please. Go natural twenty. Oh no! no. The look just gone. So please, I have a. The D4 again? Samad? Of course, every time it depends <laughs> if you tell me. In total, with my perception and the dice and everything, <clears throat> is 10. Okay. Um, the average. If you, like, if you tell me you're searching something beforehand, I'm going to do it. But if I don't know, I can't do it. Okay. So ten. Uh, so the like the way the the angle is positioned, um, there is not a lot of uh, like of background per se. Okay. Like it's a lot. It's mainly the like the door and uh, the the wall around. Uh, so there's not a lot of landscape to kind of. Um, uh, go about like finding a marker or something. Uh, there, there, there is maybe like on the side some like mountains, um, but it's hard to tell if it's the artist kind of uh, imagination or if it's okay. represent actual mountains. Um, but if you're able to get a copy, maybe it could help. Can I have a copy? Hey, you're you me? elf. <laughs> the elf, but I don't know the name. Mr. Monk. Scribeman. Uh, <laughs> yes. Uh, sorry, my my name is uh, Akhed. Akhed? Yes. Akhed. Uh, I, I don't think I, I told you guys, so that's my bad. Um, what 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 do you need? Can I have a copy of this image here? Um, it can be done. It takes time, though. Oh, how much time? And, uh, I can have someone copy it probably in two days. It's gonna cost you maybe five gold. Okay, I pay it. Sorry? I I, I pay the five gold, but I, I need a copy of this. 
Okay. Yeah. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll put someone on the desk right now. You can come back and uh, it should be done in two days. Okay. And if you can copy to be behind the, the copy of the photo, uh, some of the descriptions that say in this book, and I, and I, uh, put the, the, the page where I found the information about the cape and the clues about where it is, where I can, uh, uh, get the, the cape. So I ask him to add that clues behind the photo. You want a summary of the book on the other page? Well, yes. <laughs> but summary sounds like, ah, sounds do, like, oh. You do, have do we have any papers summary. we can write on? Yeah. To so make our own us. notes? Asking me? Yeah. I'm, I'm asking uh, Hakid. Hakid. Does it have a H in the front or not? No. So it's just Hakid. Hakid. Uh, I, well, I mean, we have paper, but it's for the library. Uh, usually people bring their own paper to take notes. <laughs> I I'll look turn. at Wait. Sook. <laughs> Wait, I have to turn the other way. <clears throat> to, to the other way. He's not picking his arm. So, don't you have any scrap paper we could use? You mean my Kindle? Yeah, your Kindle <laughs> papers. Yeah. At least one. Yeah, yeah, I'll give them everything. It's good. Nice. It's fine. I was gonna negotiate, but. No, it's paper. I'm good. <laughs> so with that paper, I started taking notes of the clues and good. And and I give you the five gold for the photo. It will be done. It shall be done. Anything else that I can do for you tonight? Have you uh, found any, uh, today? Any important names of those of this family? Yeah, I I found the name. Okay. That is the name of the house that is yet to, to be, be determined later. Yeah, the name of the family, but mm. the name of people. That's what we mm. need. Well, we know that the name of the house is their last name, so that's our best chance to okay. get more names. And mm -hmm, I mm -hmm, think mm -hmm. that's it. Did you tell us about the minerals that were harvested in uh, the cave? They're magical. But he they're, doesn't say... They're just magical. <laughs> no, but that it's in their properties that kind of... Yeah. They can be used to enchant stuff like fuse animals together. <laughs> That's what we do now. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> I got a plan. Human <laughs> and cat. Come on, people. We can do. Fury. Nope. Get an apple. <laughs> apple and, pen. And a pen. Yeah. And a pen. And a pineapple. <laughs> <laughs> well, a pine and an apple. Pineapple pen. So. But I, I know the in the book said the nature of the stone. Oh. What kind of stone it is? They weren't talking uh, specifically about stone. Okay. What you gathered was more like um, uh, what what was done in the the cave. Uh, there there is there was material that can be extracted with high. A magical property that could be used as catalyst for uh, all type of enchantment. Yes, like what you guys are used to, like uh, enchanted weapons and uh, shield, but 
it also talks about like stuff that you don't see as much anymore like animating stuff do or... we take another hour or we're done i think we're done yeah i think we're good yeah and in today's i'm i come back for my photo all right yeah thanks hey kate thank you uh see you in two days Is it two days? Two days. Yeah. Oh my. Yeah. All right. Uh, and with that, my job is done. We could have looked for. What the hell is the stone that Zook has? It's my Ooh. stone. Doesn't matter. Okay. It's my stone. <laughs> That stone could be something from that cave. Probably. Could be, could be that the bees came from that cave. Could it be? Or that Why someone not? made maybe the bees. Plot that twist. Stone. So maybe you should follow the monster steps and see where it came from. Huh. Which would probably be washed away, but whatever By happened now. in the past five yeah, days. Yeah, By I now, mean, yeah. yeah. That would have been a good idea back then. Yeah, back yeah, then. Yeah, but we, we didn't made. have this information. But it was dark. So, so are you we... You did try, to be fair. Yeah, it was raining yeah. and we couldn't try. Yeah, it was raining, I just remembered yeah. you right. So, are we planning on, on going back to Fendel and find the cave first? Or what's the... Uh... We're going well, to the thunder first, tree. First your... We're going to the thunder tree. And first your satchel. Your... Yeah, it's in the morning, but your oh. paper is the morning after. Yeah, but... Okay, okay. We get the carry-on. Oh, wait, I have to go the other way. We go to thunder tree. Come well, back the next day. we have to go to thunder tree. I don't know. All right. How long is it to thunder tree? Where the hell is Where Darren? Is there, like... Six hours. Hey, I'm here. Hey. He's been with us all along. Hey. Yeah, he, he didn't. He was he didn't right there. Like, no, you, you, guys, you guys just meet at the uh, just randomly outside the library when you get out. Isn't that awesome that we meet randomly when we talk about you? Super great. Hey. That's so amazing. Done. Almost. Mad. I was. I was actually also thinking about you guys. Um. Any idea when yeah. you guys wanted to leave? Have you have you found everything that you needed? Any all the help potion, all the equipment, food? Help potion. <laughs> <laughs> wink, wink. If somebody needs some. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, nice. Uh... I got to thank now. I don't need the health potion or health. An elf potion? Okay. I think you're the one who needs it the most. I'm amazingly good at what I do, and it is not dying. <laughs> um, so, Darren, how long is it to Tundra Tree? Um, that's a good question. It was six hours or something? I know it's near. Uh, Why I, I have wish I had a map hours. It's six hours in different direction, right? Yeah. For some reason um, I have that it's, I have that. It's one third of the journey to Fendelin. Yeah, so we we'd we'd be coming back on their steps. No. No. It's no. Sideways. It's like Fendelin okay. is down here. We went to Neverwinter and like Thunder Tree yeah. is uh, a little bit to the side. Or it's it's, uh, it's less than a day walk. Okay. So we can go now. Well I mean if you if you if you leave in the very early morning, you get there by like uh, the end of the night. 
Night, not the, oh. the end of the night, but uh, the end of the day. Okay, it's fine. Well, I mean, we can do it. All right, we we should leave uh, first thing in the morning. Okay. Let's yeah. um. Let's just rest. Let, let's go check on our uh, ladder worker guy. Yeah, let's go. The laughing dude. I will remember this. You're oh, you're going now. What time is it? I think we I think we should just walk right now to Thunder uh the Thunder Peak, no. Thunder Tree. Tree, sorry, yeah. But if we walk well, I... right now to Thunder Tree, we're gonna make like halfway there. We're gonna have to camp out. Then oh, I thought we'd to... make it by night there. Okay. No, if bad. we leave early morning, we do. Mm -hmm. Like okay. it's a whole day walk. All right, let's find me a magic shop then. I'll take you to the magic shop. Do, 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 do. I said soup donkey stuff. Do, 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 do. Till you're gonna hit this button. Whoa! <laughs> All right. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Stop screwing the whole layout. <laughs> <clears throat> so, what are you doing? I need I need regents, so Imagine. might as well go back to the marketplace. We find everything sense? on market. I need I need I basically what do I need? What do I need exactly? Paper. I need charcoal, incense, and herbs. So I'm guessing I don't and know. Ink? No ink. No. You're thinking of a different spell. I'm not going for that spell. I'm going for something different. No, I'm thinking about translating spells in your book. Yeah, that's not what I'm doing. <laughs> I, I, I have paper and um, I is it ink that I'm missing right now? Yeah, I have too little ink, but that's not that's not the plan right now. I am looking for these region, so I'm not sure in that kind of market where I could find about uh, incense, herb, and charcoal. It has to be like a magical region shop, right? Absolutely. Okay. There, has, there has to be one. There has to be one. Like it's impossible. Sema is laughing. Why is Sema laughing? I'm gonna ask around for that shop. I mean, wait, wait, so. wait. That's not my issue right now. I'm gonna go to Sema since he he owns the old city, because that's what Zooks believes. I ask him <laughs> where the region sort of shop is. It's canon now. All I think about is how you have a big, huge ass city. That's yours. What, what kind of what kind of thing are you looking at? I need a I need charcoal and incense and herbs. I need like ten gold out of it. A lot of it. Maybe incense you could buy the church and charcoal you could find the uh, Yeah, I ask you. Yeah, I asked that last time on one of my two first time on uh, a playing dungeon, and when when I said, "Can I just take charcoal from anywhere?" It, it, people started laughing, so I don't know anymore. Because I remember I stuck, I I I think I was piling up corpse or something in that cavern. I was like, "If I burn it, that's charcoal, right?" And it wasn't, because it's it has to be wood. I just realized yeah, that now. Wood, yeah. Yeah, okay, never mind. Yeah, that could that could work. I could go to church and get the incense there. And the uh, charcoal from a barbecue. I don't know. I'm, I'm <laughs> You tell me some that's your city, man. Uh, uh, I'm looking at you with I'm like you glowing eyes. No, no, I didn't. You said that city was yours. Yeah, uh the all powerful Samath. Are, are we your group? Like, where's your group? Where's your traveling group? Where's your friend? Where are your friends? Me? Yeah. I'm traveling point with to you. Me, uh, point to me a friend that you have. I'm going to point to Myra. All right. The first so one gave me. You own her. I own Tamara? Do, we, do you own her? Oh, Just no. That she's yours. You have her. I am so... 
so not understanding. I look and so good. Right. But so what I said is this is my city. Like this is your friend. But I do not own the city. Like you do not own Tamara. If if I had to roll to see if I understand him, can I do that? Oh fucking <laughs> stupid are you? I'm I, I rolled I rolled a twenty. No, I rolled a one on you telling me the city was yours. Right now, it's gonna take a roll for me to stop believing roll. that. That was yeah, that was the last line. What was it? What roll? What was that? Deception, whatever? No, he's telling me the uh, truth. It was insight. I don't know. I mean, what you did was inside. All right, let's see if I understand what he says. All right, okay, good. I get your metaphor. It's all right. Good. You know, sometimes but I really I, doubt about your real age and I don't know, maybe your race. Maybe I'm gonna, kid, you know, I'm gonna He's walk away and throw fireballs. A little hurt broken. It's all I'll say. Uh, it's all I say. Darren is gonna say. Um, if you're look, if you're looking for like magic stuff, I used to know a place. I don't know if it's still there. I could show you. Let's go there. Yes. It's a bit. Right. Do, we, do I need regions? Is it somebody that you used to know? All right, that would be my cue. <laughs> What's up with the singing tonight? <laughs> There's our friends everywhere. <laughs> um, yeah, it is someone that yeah. used to know. Somebody! <laughs> <clears throat> What'd you say, honey? You want me to hang up? I'll do that just right now. <laughs> it is in the less... Uh, more creepy side of town, though. Love it. Take me there. All right, so you start following Darren. Uh, Is it about, really like... Darren? Inside check. I'm going to be checking my pockets. Here Go for it. Uh... I'm counting Ooh, on Fern to check actually. me out. Uh, 16. Ooh, let's go. Nice. Uh, We've been double Darren. ganged before. <laughs> Uh, f from what you can tell, it, it is absolutely Darren. Okay. So he's... Weird role, man. <laughs> he starts uh, guiding you uh, to, like, around different streets, turn a couple of corners, and you see, like, kind of uh, the energy and uh, the kind of people changing as uh, you move forward. Uh, until you reach a, a, a place of town and you get the feeling is similar to I don't know if you've watched uh, Harry Potter like the, the first one or I don't know if it's the first one but when you get out of the uh, when you get out of the private drive I think mm -hmm. uh, it, there's some like shady place it's like darker there's like drunk people on the street yeah the dark alley yeah yeah, and uh, there's shady people with a uh, hood that walks in. Uh, you, you don't feel as like comfortable. Um, and everyone's kind of looking at each other suspiciously. And you get to a, a, a small shop. Um, it's kind of uh, like all wood. Uh, it is like red curtain in the the windows there's like nothing really displayed um it's a like normal door there's a small sign and it reads uh the elder scroll i want to know you said it was a normal door is it a double door all right <laughs> come <Yes>. on <laughs> <laughs> He's gone for real, man. <laughs> Can't do it. Yeah, you, every time so, I leave, I, that Simath just moves somewhere. We don't know where. Just disappear. Yeah. You want to see me moving? <laughs> <laughs> All 
All right, let's get let's get in those double doors. <laughs> in in the Elder Scroll, I got that one too. By the way, the ah, yeah. there you go, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> Screw you! I just took over. You all get free XP. You rise up a level. Woo! Let's Good go. Night. <laughs> you changed it. <laughs> All right, so you enter uh, the shop. So, um, for the sake of uh, of time consumption, I think I'm I'm not gonna roll. I think play that's out the window, man. The the <laughs> window, man. I think that's out the window. <laughs> I mean, I'm I'm trying. I'll try to make it quick since me and uh, Matt and Fern took the. Uh, the <laughs> 30 minute last time just, to make a, a, a saddle how it's gonna end it in the cliffhanger mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. i mean we can uh end it here because i i kind of wanted to role play uh because you guys have been asking for a magic shop since the beginning so i did prepare a magic shop come on oh, we can oh, role play oh, no, i don't no, mind no, let's no, go no. let's give it a shit let's late, go man, and we're ruined oh, what no money Second I, I get in, I cast this is sleep the on the hunger. guy. The store, <laughs> the magic store. Don't show Se us the magic shop while we don't have any money. I, I oh, have I a mean, little it's bit not of money. my fault. <laughs> it did cost us 20 gold for that, that goddamn saddle. Yeah, and I already spent like money in photographs and everything. Ooh, Fern, do you remember that you have to pay part? Uh, when we actually get the saddle, do you still have gold? Yeah, I'm still fine. Okay. But uh, the armor yet? Yeah. Oh. Good uh, point. Let's go, kind, the, kind sir. Yeah, I actually don't remember uh, if you guys paid for the saddle. Like I halfway? did. I gave. I, I gave You're ten hoping? gold. No, it's missing fifteen gold. Oh okay. Yeah. It was twenty five gold for for a sturdy letter, uh, instead of our own letter, which I went for, and uh, I I did give uh, ten gold of uh, out of my pocket. And then Fern said Good. he covered the uh, rest of it, but you know he's bad at math, so you think it's fifty fifty. Yep. I want to see what is the Puma soul of this Elder Scroll. Mm hmm. I'm kind of curious now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Well, I think it's a good place to end it then. <laughs> okay. da, 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 da. We need scaring song for the next part. <laughs> it's too expensive. I'm going to go. You don't like my somebody. song about the magic shop? Come on. I'm, it's not a magic market. shop. No? Yeah. I can, I'll take you to the region shop. I'll take you to I'll the region take. shop. Each time he makes one of these jokes. Internally, I'm pretty sure I lose a year of my life. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how. I don't know how that works, but I just know it. But I'm serious. Okay. What? Yeah. Well, we're gonna yeah. pick it up yeah. next time. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Good. All right. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I okay. 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 Yeah. 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 I, I I wasn't too sure if you guys were like I'm waiting I'm for me to. Get... I, no. No. I'm no. Waiting. No. 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 I mean, I'm waiting. <laughs> I'm waiting. I, I could wait. I could wait. <laughs> No, no. So Semath gave us a level and gold, right? Yep. That's what you said. It's a preparing yeah. shop, so I can explore the shop, right? Sorry? It's up. You, you prepared the shop, so can I explore the shop? <laughs> I think you she wants board. to keep going. You, you, you owe me 300 gold. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to get something to pay you. I mean, if there's only one shopkeeper and Kidio really wants to roleplay that shopkeeper, I just go in and cast sleep. That's it. Oh, yeah. I, we can no, take whatever I, we want. I just want a voice. Nice. I, I, I just want a voice. He, like, he's like, oh, I really yeah, want to roleplay yeah. that one. Oh, you I really want, want to roleplay? I cast sleep. Oh. But. My character that yeah, it took but... so long to make. Have you seen? Have you seen? Actually, have you seen Pumat fight? The, the yeah. Intrude, the yeah. Put it's him to fight. sleep. <laughs> like, no. <laughs> if he's worthy, uh, if he's a worthy NPC for a roleplay that much, he's gonna be powerful. 
maybe we get friends to this guy. Or, or, and hear me out. We steal him blind. That's all I'm saying. We finally <laughs> found a magic shop. Maybe you should take Suki's side before you enter the shop. I think, I think yeah. you're, you're, you overestimate your saddle, your new mount. All right. So yeah. first of all, I've got fire spells. And I'm insanely good. Maybe, I rock the world, baby. Maybe he yeah, can you have one you. fireball. Okay, okay. First of all, I don't have fireball, which is an issue. You have I'll one. Have I, no. You use it? I mean, one. What do you mean you one? Oh, I have a scroll of a fireball. Yeah. How flammable does the shop transcribe with? that shit into your manuscript? I could, I could transcribe yeah. the, the parchment in my book. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, dude, I'm learning. I'm learning. You I should ink. definitely do that. But do you have a do you have turn level spell though? Slot? And you need to be able to no. cast it. No, I don't have third level spells. Yeah, that's right. You can't cast it yet. Can I can I copy it but not cast it? Does that make sense? You need to be able to cast it. Okay. Okay. So who knows what I'm gonna do with ten gold worth of incense. And then I, what I, I, I guess third so thing. Hmm? Well, I'm going to see. Yep. What's what? Next session? Probably uh, going to be. What are you pointing at? Thunder. I don't know. His finger. Thunder. Feel the thunder. <laughs> it's fine. You'll get it next time. <laughs> what did you say, Alex? Next session is going to. Might look the same as this one. <laughs> I mean, well, maybe, well, not really. Really. we want to explore the store. To be on, yeah. yeah, explore the store is we fine. I just no can't money. wait. We money. Well, I don't we know. We don't need money. We can, we That's can a... probably lend Zook for a couple days. Yeah. Oh. Is but... there a kinder, like a Zook kindergarten dimension, like in Rick and Morty? <laughs> yeah, there is. It's a block of ice. Like a Jerry kindergarten. Yeah, a whole a whole dimension. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> it's called the pensioner. It's, <laughs> it's just the like, old people house. Just like it's NPCs, just Zook. Like Zook can just put to sleep. <laughs> Zook's putting each other to sleep. The perfect counter to Zook. Zook. I want to really know this NPC from this store. A mirror. What they're talking about is a mirror. I can't sleep on myself nonstop. <laughs> <laughs> you just, <laughs> you just put him like, like a, a glass with mirrors. Yeah, it's like a the same as bl blinders for horses. Yeah. But it's, mm -hmm. it's, it's just a pair of glasses with mirrors. <laughs> I would like to say that the last time that I casted sleep. We got it a worked compass. Really bad. <laughs> it worked perfectly. We <laughs> look. We get out you almost we... all died. Okay. Sure almost all to. died. Come on. We're part of an adventure. Danger <laughs> is part of the course. Death <laughs> is part of the adventure. <laughs> I mean, death, not TPK. Hey, yeah. what's my biggest AOE I could do in a shop? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if the whole city is on fire, they're not going to look for a small gnome. They're going to try and turn, <laughs> turn, turn their fire maybe, maybe down. Maybe they're going to look on a, 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 a gnome strapped to a giant, though. No, we're the uh, firemen's the police. I can make a sound. Yeah. yeah, that's it. I'm on the top of it. Everyone get out! There is a huge fire. I'm higher, so my 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 vowel voice is right God, I need I need to watch that movie now. Damn it. Damn it! Uh, what what movie, movie was that? That's that's Ace Ventura. Oh, oh. right. Great. Alrighty then. All right. 
All right. Right. Yeah. All right. Yep. Ah. So when's our next VR session? Because I really want to go back to the fur. Oh hub. yes.